Hey everyone, uh, this is Dan B, the developer of StudyDroid and StudyDroid.com, and I'm just going to show off some features uh, of the newest version, um, the new the new UI, and um, and some of the older features. This will kind of be like a tutorial on on how to use it, some use cases of of the StudyDroid application um, for Android. So if you look, here's the the home the home screen comes up, but you can see it's been all um, hollowized, so now we have the little action bar on top instead of the menu button. The uh, the menu button still works, it'll still bring up all of the extras, like uh, the instructions are clearing the packs or backs or backing up. Um, but the, the most used buttons are up here. So we have adding a new pack, you just click on the little add button and you can add a new pack. New pack. Uh, syncing, which is a very highly used option, and we'll get to that later and then the preferences which will let you change a whole bunch of different things like the text size depending on on your android tablet or your uh, your phone maybe you want it bigger or smaller whether you want the text to be centered on the front and the back um, if you want to wrap the pack so that at the at, once you get to the end of one it'll go back to the beginning or if you just want it to stop there um, showing where you downloaded them from displaying the cards that you already know and the text and background color um, I'll go back and these, you can all access these from up here. Now, if I click on one of the, the packs, like let's go to the instructions, then you can see it pops up with an old familiar interface, and I'm, I'm working on a newer one too. It'll be really exciting. And uh, I still have the hollow bar up here with, with again, the most, the most used um, options. So you can click this one, and that will let you edit the card that you're currently on. Or you can click to add a new card. One. You can click to add a new card and then it'll let you add a new one. Or you can click on here to view them as a list, and that'll let you search through them if you want to search through which cards you want. Um, and it displays them in this quick, easy format, and then if you click on one, it'll actually take you to that card right here, and it says position updated to let you know that you've moved you've moved in, in inside the pack. So all like, these, these are all functions that were in the other version, um, and you need Android version 3.0 or above to, to see this, uh, this little hollow bar here. Um, and, but it makes it makes a lot easier to to get around inside the application. In fact, if I click on one, instead of having to hitting instead of having to hit the back button, sorry, because I know that there are a lot of uh, phones that don't have back buttons, a lot of the newer ones that are going away from this little bar down here, uh, you can just click up top there, and it'll it'll bring you right back to the home screen. So that's uh, that's you know, all you all you have to know is up here in the uh, the hollow bar. Alright, and now I'm going to show you how to use the sync feature on StudyDroid in the application and on uh, the server. It does a two-way sync, so it will download any changes from the website to your Android device, and any changes that you make on your Android device will also go back up to the website if, if they're newer. Um, so I'm just going to do a little simple example here of how that works. You can click on the, uh, the state capitals here. It has all the state capitals, you know, Pennsylvania, Rhode Island, etc. But it's kind of shuffled, so I'm going to click on the list here, and it's going to show it in order. And I'm going to go look for California. There's California. That's because that's my, my home state. So California, Sacramento, is the capital. And I'm going to edit it. And let's say, you know, we don't like Sacramento. And we're going to say that... LA is the capital of California. I'll probably be getting many angry emails for this. So now we're saying, huh, LA is the capital of California. And if we look up here, I have the Study Droid website in front of me. And you can see um, all my packs, which is where I'm at. I have all of, all of my different packs. And of course, only the starred ones are the ones that will get synced. So you only click on the star over here, and that, that'll tell the system which ones you really care about. Um, so I'm going to go to the state capitals, and I'm going to view it. And you can see here, the uh, if I search down through it, find California. You can see it's still says Sacramento, because I haven't synced yet. So what I'm going to do is go back down to the Android application. And I'm going to exit out using the new hollow bar. And then I'm going to click on sync. 
and then I'm going to sink it. Um, do its little thing for a little while. Okay, and now that it's done, if I go back up here and I go back to my packs and I go to the state capitals and view them again, when I go down to California, you see it says LA is the capital. And uh, now, of course, they're going to say that that's, that's not right. LA is not the capital of California. No, 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 no. I'm going to say it's Sacramento. That's, that's correct. Who would, who would type that? So now that's it. Just click here to save. So it's all saved up. And now, you know, I've made that, I've made that fix and it's all, it's all saved. If I go back here, here and then sync. We'll do this little thing. There we go, it's synced. Now I'll go back to the state capitals. California. Sacramento! Hey! Everything's right again. And that's how you sync uh, from the Android application to studydroid.com. And then if you make any changes, it gets synced back again. Uh, if you have any questions, email me, support at studydroid.com. Or you can post in the forums. Um, which, if you look at the site, just go to the forum, a lot of people there to help you out too. But, happy studying, good luck on all your, uh, your tests, I know finals are coming up for some of you, so, um, have fun and happy studying!